My name is Melanie Deronia, reporter with Westford Cat, and here is the August 13th edition of Westford Cat News. Massachusetts lawmakers recently approved a $56 billion state budget, which has been signed by Governor Moore Healy at the time of recording. Westford only received one line item on the budget, with a $100,000 allocation for the design and construction of a new playground at NAB NASA Elementary School. The town of Westford also received over $17.8 million in Chapter 70 funding for public elementary and secondary schools, with an additional $2.5 million in unrestricted government aid for the town. The deal also includes funding to help Bay Staters over 25 attend community college for free, as well as additional funding for the state's health insurance program, MassHealth. Included in the $56 billion state budget is over $170 million in funding for a pandemic-era program that provided free school meals for students regardless of income. Now that program, which began in 2020 and was expanded through 2023, becomes permanent. Food Service Director at Westford Public Schools, Colleen Wallace, told Westford Cat, quote, I am very excited that the Massachusetts legislator has decided to make free meals permanent. She added that WPS will, quote, continue to offer the same quality and variety of meals, including fresh fruits and vegetables daily. All first meals will be free for all Westford Public School students, including breakfast and lunch. Second meals and entrees, incomplete meals and a la carte purchases such as desserts, snacks, and bottled water will not be covered by the Universal Free Lunch Program. Westford's own Molly Smith makes history as the first woman to qualify for the Massachusetts Amateur Championship in the tournament's 115-year history. The tournament originally tweed off on July 10th, with Smith failing to make the cut on the second day of stroke play on July 11th. To Smith, making history was not about breaking barriers. She told Westford Cat that she saw this tournament as, quote, any other tournament. Smith, who played for Westford Academy, now sets her sights on the University of Central Florida, where she will continue to, pay, to play on a scholarship. Smith says she may, quote, take a shot at professional golf in the future. Don't forget, we still have spaces left for our Lights, Camera, Action Kids Camp this summer. We will host a week of camp from August 14th to August 18th, and another from August 21st to August 25th. Bring your friends and create your own video with our state-of-the-art public access studio. Sign up online through Rodenbush Community Center or call the studio at 978-692-7152. That's all for this week. I'm Melanie Deronio, and you're watching Westford Cat News.